New this morning in entertainment news, Khloe Kardashian and Lamar Odom have reached a settlement and signed off on their divorce. According to U.S. Weekly, the divorce likely won't be officially finalized until December. A judge cannot sign off under California state law until at least six months after the initial divorce filing. Kardashian refiled back in May. Now, the former couple's separation has been a long process. Kardashian first filed in December 2013, only after four years of marriage. She then withdrew the papers to serve as Odom's caretaker after his near-fatal overdose at a Nevada brothel last October. Chloe is now dating Cleveland Cavaliers player Tristan Thompson. There are reports that Mariah Carey has broken off her engagement to James Packer. The pair called things off after getting in a fight while on vacation last month. An insider told U.S. Weekly Carey said Packer wasn't, quote, present enough. But a rep for Packer said simply this was not true. Now, the story really is kind of a hot mess. Carrie's rep then said the fight was not because of any cheating allegations or excessive spending by Mariah. Right now, they're not sure if they will stay together, but we're hearing that they are trying to work things out. We wish them the best. <laughs> and speaking of Mariah Carey, she is canceling concerts in Brazil, Argentina, and Chile on her Latin America tour. According to E! News reports, the singer is citing promoter negligence as the reason. Carey will still be performing in Mexico City and Monterey, Mexico in November. All canceled tickets will receive refunds. Broad City star and co-creator Abby Jacobson is out with a new illustrated book called Carry This Book. In the bizarre story, Jacobson imagines what celebrities like Oprah carry in their bags. I try to get inside these people's heads while at the same time kind of poking fun at them or commenting on something I find um, admirable about them. Pages are also devoted to Beyonce and Marilyn Monroe. So what do you think mm. is in Oprah's bag? I know, I actually... Answer that while I finish my makeup. Okay, I would say... <laughs> Altoids, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. her glasses, because she wears glasses, oh, maybe yeah, a Weight point, Watchers book. Yeah, that's a good point, too. Because now she is a spokeswoman for yeah. Weight Watchers. Clint, any, right. any ideas? I have no idea what's in Oprah's purse. Lipstick, cell phone. Mm -hmm. Oh, all that, yeah. Probably wads and wads and oh. wads of money. money. Yeah. Oh, or just yeah. one really big credit card. Hers is really true. big. It's not just it's <laughs> a really okay. big credit card. So I think card. I'm now ready. You ready? Oh, ready to go? I told him earlier, I feel like a sloth today. Just slow and it's Friday. I know yeah. that I am happy about it. But you excited. look good, Jillian. Yeah. Okay, thank you. As a sloth, you look good. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Jacqueline. <laughs> All right now, let's do our water cooler question for today. Ten percent of people do this in the bathroom <laughs> at work. Oh, oh, oh wow! Is it? <laughs> and, you know, most put on their makeup, but here we just do it right here on television. <laughs> well, I guess they could. Uh, Take the newspaper with them. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay. Wow, wow, wow. <coughs> Ooh, we brush your teeth. Brush their teeth. Maybe oh, yeah, that's a pretty good one. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I live for these questions every single morning. You need to get a live. Yeah, we need to, <laughs> <laughs> we need to talk I'm so later. exciting. I just yeah. can't help myself. <laughs> we want to hear your guesses on Facebook this morning at KYTX CBS 19. We'll give you the answer at about 655.